Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Welcome to the show, everybody. Oh, you know when you go in the gym sometimes, you like to want to walk out, you know? For me, oh, yeah, I know that. I like to walk that way. <laughs> wow, that's how we do it. Welcome, everybody. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. Tonight's show is going to be amazing because we have two special guests joining us on the show. When we talk about production, we talk about movies, we talk about uh, writing books, talk about general things. This is the kind of guest we have tonight, and we're all looking forward to it because we're going to enjoy so many things about those people because there's so many things to share with us. That's what we're looking for tonight. But tonight's show, before we do that, let's go to the Ask Chris, everybody. Okay, so I know we have a special question from Joe. Hello, Joe. How you doing? Good. Joe is my name. Hi, Chris. How are you doing? I'm very good, Joe. Like you can see. Thank you. How do you stay productive all the time? Thank you very much, Joe. That's a very good question. Just to answer those questions, I just have three points I would like to share with you. This is so very, very important. The first one is about hard working. The second one is talk about your target. And the third one is talking about your goal. So these three things are very, very important as we grow every day in our lives. Being productive is about what you know about, what you believe in, what you trust in. That would definitely help you to become that productive. Knowing your target, most times when we do things, if we don't know our target of what we're actually being productive of, that does not help us. Being productive is part of being profitable. We look at, oh, I want to be productive here, yeah, but at the same time I want to be profitable. When we talk about profitable, profitable is not just about making money, but what you have in your heart that you believe in, you share with everybody every day. You do beyond the expectation, just like some of us that work, who work more than 20 hours every day or 16 hours. That is what we talk about, being profitable. I know definitely you need the money. That money will come some way, somehow. But in all of these three points I've shared with you to, to, today, being profitable, be powerful by what you do, know your target, be able to strive for your goal as much as you can. All of these three points would really help you. And I hope I've shared something out with you because that's what I do every day. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. That's how we do it on the show every week. So keep joining us every week as we bring more motivational uh, speeches there for you. But before we kick off tonight's show, let's go to the Chris and Terry before we bring our main guests on the show. So take it away. Thank you. Terry. What? Come on. No, Chris. I need to meditate. No more. Install them electric locks. What a stupid idea, Chris! <sighs> oh man, I'm still in here. I wasn't this room. Ah, a parachute. Let's go get a drink. Ah, ah. Oh. oh, it's so bad. Oh, it's hard. Oh, so good. So good at the same time. Oh, man. I gotta get out of here. Somebody has to know. Neve has to even ring my phone to say, Where, Where's Terry? Chris, have you seen Terry? No, I'm not from work. There's some stuff over here. What's, what's this? Oh, yes! 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 Ah. Yeah, okay. They'll find you soon, Terry. They'll find you soon. Hear the noise, they'll hear you moving stuff. Who's making that noise, they'll say. You know, there has to be somebody in there. Has to be somebody in the storage. Who was in the storage last? Maybe Terry went in there. You know? That's <laughs> Now we're, we're smoking. Mr. Pan, you got food for me like Peter Pan does? Oh, yeah, look at that big cauliflower. Oh, yeah. Um, 
It works for Peter Pan, why won't it work for me? Yeah. Come on. <laughs> hey, have you seen Terry? No, not since the other day. He just left with the chairs and didn't come back. And he left his stuff here. Yeah, I'll give him a ring. Yeah, you skim right now. God, hope nothing happened to him. I think his phone's over there. Oh no. That's been there for a while then. <laughs> I don't even know where time has gone On my own for so long On my own Time is gone Me and one tank have What are you doing here? Living Living like a king King, Terry? How long have I been gone, Chris? I've been looking for you for the last few weeks I've been on my own for so long Time I have to gone. call the ambulance. Okay? Okay, Chris. This is not looking good. Can I still direct your show, Chris? Thank you. Wow. I don't know what's happening with Terry in that stage, honestly. Do you all know what happened to Terry then? No. Come on, show us. Just... I don't know. That's Terry for you. Anyway. Please join me to welcome my very first guest on the show. It's another person, the singer, songwriter, Paul on the show. Please, thank you. Woo! Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Thank you. How are good you? to see you. Very good. Thank you for coming on the show. No problem. Great, <laughs> great. So tell us about yourself. Um, I'm just a songwriter that comes from a different place and lived in a different place, and I'd love sharing those experiences with other people. Very good, very good. And originally, where are you from? Uh, Czech Republic. Wow, fantastic. So talk us through some of your kind of song you, you do. Um, I, a lot of the times I focus on mental health and the issues that um, some people might have with mental health. Yes. But also the struggles of a foreign person living in a different foreign country that's wow. completely different to their very own. Very true, very true. So well, the kind of music is around the mental health issues yeah. and other kind of areas. And um, tonight you're going to be singing a song for us tonight. Yes. Right, so what kind of song are you going to be singing for um, us tonight? It's a song about myself and my struggles with uh, social anxiety disorder. Very good. So it's a very personal song. Wow. And um, it's a good way to help other people understand what me having mental health problems is like. Super. And at the moment, how are you feeling in terms of your mental health issue? Are you, are you in a positive yeah, kind of light right at this now stage, yes? on, on the roller coaster on the up. Very good, very good. want to wish you good luck and all. Thank we you. don't want to take much of your time. One more time, everybody, please. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for coming on the show. So, viewers at home, stay for more of the show because my very good friend, Terry, is going to be right there. We're going to talk about what we're talking about music, we talk about production, movies, and all the rest. We'll be right back after this. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you.